Hi everybody, today you're here with Carla Jones. I'm a dental student in my fourth year at the University of Michigan School of Dentistry and I'm from Lansing. I'm very excited to graduate this year in May and become a pediatric dentist. Pediatric, pediatric dentist, dentist, let's, let's go. go. They're just baby teeth, so if they fall out, you know, if they get decay, who cares? They're gonna get a new set of teeth. That is that that many people have, but we can't ignore the health effects of a baby that has decayed teeth. Um, that can affect their other dental development, but more, more so, it can also affect the overall development of that child. Constantly being in a state of agony from painful teeth isn't going to be good. Um, another thing is those teeth are important for the new, next teeth to come in. You want to have those teeth maintain the space. One of the things you brought up concerning crowding, I always think back to that J. Cole song, like Crooked Smile, like, okay, it's, it's big, everybody loved it. I'm not gonna bring my feelings about J. Cole into this, that's a different video. The point I'm trying to make is actually getting your teeth properly aligned uh, prevents cavities from developing from the overlaps, prevents plaque buildup in between the overlaps, the bacteria and all the organisms that are literally hiding in spaces, well, the lack of spaces. I think it has to do with the community people live in. If you can't have access to you know, healthy foods and a lot of the foods you might snack on are carbs and you might have a lot of pop in your area, you know, it's maybe more likely that that person ends up with dental decay than someone who is you know, knows more about dental health. They go to the dentist every six months. They are eating nutritious foods. They have money to have a toothbrush, toothpaste, and they have that awareness. So eating habit changes while also providing the foods necessary so that that eating habit can then be sustainable. Because look, if you're addicted to sugar because sugar is an addictive substance and research it, Google it, I'm telling you now, Girl Scouts, hey, they put in my mind. I'm Carla. I am not a 4.0. I'm not a 3.9. I'm not 3.8. I'm no number. I'm no certain title, even though I have titles. Those are not defining who I am as a person. So I encourage everyone to love themselves for who they are on the inside.